We are back with another quarter hunt. This is box number three for 2021, and we have yet to score silver in our first two boxes. We keep finding Ws, which I'll take, but this time, I'm hoping we can get this box to produce some silver. Hey everybody, it's Rob with Rob Finds Treasure. That's right, we've got another quarter box to hunt. Likelihood that I'll probably marry this hunt with another box, assuming we have the type of quarter boxes we usually get with maybe a W and no silver. I have my fingers crossed though, this is gonna be a lucky box and it is unopened, so we'll do a live opening, but because there's holes on the bottom of this box, I was able to kind of peek through them to see that we had circulated quarters. Since I have you here right now, we're gonna go ahead and do this live opening and see if we have any fancy schmancy enders on top, praying that because I haven't seen one of these type of quarter boxes in a while, it's a lucky one. As you know, we struggled last year only finding four silver quarters in 60 quarter boxes. All right, well, I see a Weir Farms, I see a Lowell, I see a Kansas Quarter. So we've got some of the newer 2020 and 2019 designs, but I don't see any proofs, foreigns, or silver enders to speak of. You guys know the drill. We'll start cracking rolls, and hopefully we'll find something silvery in this box. Obviously, I'll be looking for silver, along with any quarter varieties, and the aforementioned 2020 and 2019 Ws. Let's kick it off. Roll one and see if we get lucky. We're on roll number five and we will have a variety that we have found. It is a lesser variety, but I have a 2005 Philadelphia minted Minnesota State Quarter under the scope. And this is going to be the Minnesota State Quarter DDR 019. And I'll show you the variety Vista images. You can clearly see this extra tree or tree branch, if you will, in that picture. And you can see it in ours. And the best representation is to look at ours along with that one or ours with that one. We definitely have it. Definitely an extra branch there, not supposed to be there. Again, a lesser variety, number 19, but a variety found nonetheless. Figured I'd bring up the PCGS price guide report for those wondering if there's any value in a DDR19 for the Minnesota State Quarter minted from Philly. There is a little bit of value. I mean, if you think about it being in MS63 shape, a $30 quarter. That would be if I had it graded at an MS63. This quarter doesn't really get much value more than that until we get into high, high mint states like a 66. Obviously a 65 would be good. When I pull my quarter out from under the scope and I look at it, it is a nice example. Probably an MS63, maybe a 64 or 65 if we're lucky. And I'll be honest, it almost looks like it has a satin finish and they did mint satin finish quarters but I'm not 100% sure. Could be, maybe not. Either way, happy to have found it. Bottom line is, not a submitter, but a variety for the Collection. Well, as expected and predicted, no silver in this quarter box, number three on the year. All we got was that DDR from the 05 Minnesota Extra Tree State Quarter and a ton of nicer New Mexico, Oklahoma, Iowa, and Rhode Island quarters in here that I can use for sets. There actually was quite a bit more than that, but I had to be picky because there were so many uncirculated examples that I didn't know what to do with them. To any extent, no silver once again, and I will be marrying this hunt to another box or two once I get them. I'll be back when I have another box or two and we'll pray that we'll get something silvery in one of those ones. Well, we're back again with another quarter box, quarter box number four in the year, and I might be picking up another quarter box or two tomorrow. So in the event, and the likely event, that we don't have any finds as far as silver in this box, I could be bearing this hunt to another hunt. Of course, unless there's silver and or there's quite a few Ws in the box. I took a quick peek, definitely a circulated quarter box. We're still trying to find my first uncirculated Tuskegee Airmen 2021 quarters, but those will have to wait for now. All right, we'll get right into it. We're gonna pick up where the last box left off, which was no silver, no Ws, one variety, that Minnesota 2005 Extra Tree DDR, and see if we can get lucky in this box. Fingers crossed, let's go. Well, holy cow, another skunk box. 
No W's, nothing in that box, and of course, no silver. I did pull out a couple of nicer 60s and 70s quarters that I'll compare to my collection, but that was a tough hunt, I'm not gonna lie. I tried to find something, couldn't find anything. Luckily, I have a box or two I'm picking up this week, and we'll marry that hunt with this two box hunt so far. Again, four boxes now on the year, still no silver quarters found in 2021. We only found four all last year. Is there any more silver quarters out there in my area? Let's find out when I get more boxes. A new day, another box of quarters. Ironically, this is our third different type of box for this video. But not so ironically, we've got no silver and only one find in the first two boxes and surprisingly, no Ws. Hopefully this circulated box of quarters will provide us with something for the board, silver maybe, we'll have to see. I've already checked, they're all circulated quarters. We're ready to get this hunt on. So here we go. Box three of the hunt, box five of the year. No silver quarters yet. I'll see you if and when we have a first find in this box. Well, we are back again. Box five on the year was another complete skunker. Begs the question, is it gonna be a tough year not only for silver for me in my quarter boxes, but W's as well? We're struggling. I'm gonna have to get another box and pray we have something to show you. I'll be back if I can find another box. We're back with another box, box six on the year, and this will make box four of this hunt. And it's hard to believe boxes three, four, and five did not have any W quarters I mean, I'll take the variety that we found, which is nice, but where's the W's? And of course, we don't ever find silver, so I'm not expecting that. I did pick another box up though. I did check it, it is circulated. Still can't find the 2021 quarters uncirculated boxes yet, but I'll take this box. I do see some newer designs, some newer ends. Hopefully we get a W or in the unlikely event we get some silver, that'll be a good find. All right, let's kick it off. Roll one. Will this box produce or not? We're on roll number 39, and I was beginning to think we were going to have the longest drought I've ever had without having a 2020 or a 2019 W quarter. But the second to the last quarter of this roll is going to be a 2020 W. You can tell by the privy on the front. Which design is it? And it's a Marsh Billings Rockefeller, and I don't have many of these at all. So if I was going to select one, this is the one I would want to find. And we did. Finally have a W quarter after almost four boxes in this video. Let's get back to the hunt. We've got 11 more rolls to go. See if we can find something silvery. Or another W. Box four of the hunt, box six of the year is done. And once again, it's sans silver. But we did get a W quarter and the one that I would have wanted to get. So I'm happy for that. And so far in the four box hunt, we really only have a couple of finds. Now, typically after four boxes, I'd probably end the video, but I am picking up another box tomorrow. So may as well marry that box. Maybe it's lucky number seven to the hunt. I'll be back when I have that other box from tomorrow's pickup and let's keep our fingers crossed. There's something good in it. We are back again, and I do have two quarter boxes, boxes seven and eight on the year, and boxes five and six for this hunt. So no matter what, now that I have two more boxes, there's no way I'm gonna add more boxes to this video. Hopefully, we find more Ws than the one we have found through four boxes, and hopefully find more varieties like I did for this 2005 Minnesota Extra Treat. That being said, we'll get into box seven for the year, box five for the video, and I'll bring you in if and when we find something to add to this thin board. Roll number 38, box seven on the year, fifth of the hunt. We've got another W quarter, and it's gonna be a 2020 because there's a privy on the front. Which one is it? It's another Marsh Billings, and I'm happy because like I said, when I found the last one, we don't have very many of these at all. Now we have two more from this hunt. Still no silver though. Well, box seven is completed. We added another W quarter from 2020 to the collection, but once again, failed to add silver. 
I did pull out a couple of nicer 1970 Denver and 83 Denver, which is pretty nice. And these are tough to get in good mint state because they did not make uncirculated sets in 82 and 83. They all were released into circulation. So finding one that looks like this is a nice find. I'll add it to the collection. Seven boxes down on the year, five for the hunt. We'll grab box eight, the sixth of this video, and pray we get goodies for the board. Roll number 26 of the box, and I had to write another eight on there because I realized I pulled the box back up after the first box hunt and had it reverse facing. So we're actually hunting this box backwards. Either way, box eight, six of the hunt, roll 26. I bring in because I already saw it. It was reverse facing when I flipped it, saw that it was a W. It's a War in the Pacific 2019 W quarter. Our second of the box, first from 19, the other one was a 2020, third overall for the hunt. Let's see if we can find more. And let's see if we can find some silver. Well, box eight on the year has been hunted and we have not found silver yet in 2021. And I'm starting to think that there is no more silver in my area, in my quarter boxes. This is now 68 boxes since January of 2020 and only four silvers found. It's tough. Still, thank goodness we have some W's, although the W quarter program is ended now after 2020. So we have to go and find the ones from previous years, which are getting more and more scarce now because they've been already in circulation long enough to be pulled out. That being said, we did find two Marsh Billings 2020 W's. I'll take those. And a War in the Pacific 2019 W. We also got that 2005 Minnesota Extra Tree variety, which I'll take. A couple of nice quarters for the Colección from this box and a few more steak quarters. Also found a lesser variety 2005 extra tree it just is a minor one i think it's like number 70 and with the gunk on it i'm not even going to flip it up we're going to toss it back i don't need it that's it guys i'm sorry i went through six boxes in this video to only come up with a few finds they're tough but i want to show you what it's like hunting quarters because inevitably despite people being excited about them they're a tough hunt hopefully you guys find silver in your boxes hopefully you continue to find w's i know i'll never stop hunting them although it's getting tough. If you enjoyed this six box quarter hunt video, I'd appreciate a thumbs up. And as always, everyone, happy hunting and thanks for watching. I don't know why you're so mad, 2021 Silver Jar. You knew we would find no silver while I'm hunting quarters.